See, what y'all don't know, or y'all must have forgot, like Roy Jones, is I got videos with major heavy hitters, you heard? Tony Ayo. You heard? Conway. Conway, I'm sorry. West Side Gun, I'm sorry. I don't want to hear nothing else about it. You heard? Watch my video with Jada Kiss. Swag on Pluto. Fire. MTV action was on that. You heard? Watch my video with Jim Jones. MTV action was on that. Y'all got to do the history on the kid LAZ. You heard? If you need them rap collabs, get at me, bro. I got you for the low. You heard? Yo, and make sure y'all go to genpop.store and get that merch. You heard? That's genpop.store. We got a little bit of everything. And for y'all dudes out there, that's my size, but be wanting a 5 and 6X, bro, this ain't a cash money records video shoot. You heard it's 2022. You heard? Slim that up, bro. This shit was crazy because um, my man Dane, you heard, he from Sumpner, you heard, and um, he official, you heard, he was locked up, you know, he was in country, he was in Clinton. My man introduced me to him, my man John Woo. He's like, yo, this is my man Dane. Boom, 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 boom. So ever since my man introduced me to him, we was good, you heard? Mm -hmm. So um, he, had, he, had, he had a lot of time. He had about 25, or 20, 30, 20 or 30 years. You know what I'm saying? And do, you heard? Fish you cat out of something, up, you heard? Heavy hitter, everybody know him, you know what I'm saying? But the shit was crazy because one day I go to the yard and um, it just so happens that I'm the first one in the yard. Like I'm, like my, my company, my house was the first company in the house in the yard. And um, so when I got to the yard, um, it was a, is a dude, a dude came out with glasses. Like he was standing, he was standing like, as soon as you come out, out the yard, he's standing right there at the gate by the phones watching, like you could tell that like he, where he's standing at, you can see everybody that's coming out the yard. So I, I was, I, I peeped some because I'm like, I'm like, damn, son, son standing, standing incognito on the gate on the low. You heard trying to be on the low, but he watching everything that come in the yard. So make a long story short, everything, everybody at all the houses come out to the yard. So my man John Wu come out. So my man John Wu like, yo. Yo, um, yo, Dame, Dame, Dame got a, Dame got a serious problem in here, you heard? So I'm like, well, what happened? He's like, yo, this kid named such and such, you heard? Um, they got mad beef, you heard? So we gotta hold that nigga Dame down, you heard? So I was like, all right, no problem. So we, 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 we congregating up, me, John Woo, then Dame, but then Dame pulled up on us. And then um, this other little, this other young dude from something the project pulled up on us. You heard? So it was only, it's only like, it's, it's only like four or five of us. So we go up to the hill. You know what I'm saying? And when we go up to the hill, is I'm gonna keep it official. Half of Brooklyn is up there. You heard? Half of Brooklyn is up there, cause um the, the kid little John is crazy strong. You know what I'm saying? And um he um. He he gon he gonna go gun to gun with my man Dane, you heard? So, but the shit is, the nigga Little John got all official Brooklyn niggas with him. Like he got big S, he got official Brooklyn niggas, all the official Brooklyn niggas that was in the jail holding the spot down, you heard? They with Little John because Little John is official and his brother's somebody and him and his brother is somebody out there in Brooklyn, out there in Marcy, you heard? So I'm I'm getting the story on Little John as it's going along. I, I don't know nothing about Little John until 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 this to the to the to this gun to gun about to happen, you heard? So so my man John Wu putting me on a little bit about what's going on. Like he like, yo, this nigga Dane gonna go gun to gun with this nigga. But the way it's looking you could tell like the, the other the kids that's with Little John, they don't want Little John to go gun to gun. They wanna, you could tell like niggas wanna ride on my man Dane. You heard? They, they wanna, and so if they ride on my man Dane, they gonna ride on all of us because we popping with Dane. You know what I'm saying? And Dane only had like me, John Wu, and this one kid, this little short, light skinned kid from his projects. And the only reason why the kid was with him was because they from the same projects. You know what I'm saying? And um, 
So make a long story short, the, um, the nigga Little John, so much of a real nigga, he know the Brooklyn niggas wanna ride with him and ride on Dame and all that, you heard? Because niggas could've overpowered niggas, you know what I'm saying? But Dame, Dame was up there ready to go gun to gun, so Little John was like, nah, you heard? He, um, Brooklyn kids, big S and all them niggas want to, you know, like they, they holding them down. The niggas want to really roll. I'm looking at them niggas, and I was in the jail with them niggas, so I already know how them niggas give it up. So I'm, I'm looking at them niggas like, oh shit, these niggas really want to ride. So the nigga, um, Little John, tell niggas like, nah, I'm, it's just me and him going to go gun to gun, you heard? And um, I, I looked at that nigga as, in a different light because I was like, damn, this nigga... Got the whole jail with him. He could smash niggas out, but he don't even do that. He said he want to go gun to gun. So him and him and the nigga Dane, they we up at the top of the basketball court in Clinton. You heard niggas going gun to gun. So I think um um the nigga Little John shit broke. Little Little John shit either. I think it bended. It bended. I think he had some. He had a little poker and it bended. And um Dane Dane like gave him gave him gave him like a like gave him like his breath like to get it right like Damon try to still stab like do him in even though his shit bend it so it was like it was like a, a fair joint and then the, 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 the little John tried to go in again but it, you know it really was nothing the police seen it police came running down and they and they and they, and they grabbed little John but they didn't grab my man Dame so my man Dame got away with it and little John went down you heard that was a crazy joint because the nigga Little John was official cat and he could have had niggas smashed out, but he he, he was a real dude. He, he, he wanted to go gun to gun with my man Dane. That shit was over some real shit too. Did both of them niggas get stabbed though? Um, not really. They they they, they tried to poke each other up, but Little John shit bended. So basically. Um, Dame ain't, ain't try to really go in on him after that because he was trying, like, he was trying to make it fair. You heard? Because everything was being fair. And I, 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 I guess that Dame was keeping it fair too because, you know, like, he knew he, niggas was outnumbered. You know what I'm saying? And like I told you, Little John had half of Brooklyn with him, man. When I say he had half of Brooklyn with him, he had half of Brooklyn with him. You heard? You know what I'm saying? His big, bro his big brother's majesty. Everybody knows his big brother's majesty, you heard? From out of BK, you heard? Living legend out there, you know what I'm saying? So, and Little John's a living legend. I don't know, I, um, I don't know, I heard, I, I don't know if he's still alive or whatever. I heard that he had passed away, Little John, but I, I don't know if that's true or not. You know how this shit go, you know what I'm saying? But I always respected that shit because he went gun to gun with my man Dame when he really ain't have to. You understand what I'm saying? He could have had my man Dame hit, you know what I'm saying, by anybody, you know what I'm saying? Because niggas was on deck for him, you heard? But he was a real dude. He was like, nah, going gun to gun with him. And he went gun to gun with him and it didn't even turn out like probably how he wanted it to turn out, but it's still the same day. Everything went smooth, you heard? What the niggas, what, what, what they was beefing over, you know? The word was that Dame had um killed his brother, but um Dame told me and my man John Wu that that wasn't true. But you know, you know how that shit go, man. You know what I'm saying? That was that's why I said it was some it was some major beef between them. You heard? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And Little John and, and his brother Majesty out of Marcy, they they real cats. You know what I'm saying? Especially on the on the jailhouse tip, and on you know a lot of people know them. You know what I'm saying? A lot of official hit heavy hitters, you know what I'm saying? That's why I told you that when Little John came to the jail, he had half of Brooklyn with him. You know what I'm saying? Niggas, niggas ready to put it in on Dame. You know what I'm saying? And um, Little John was like, Nah, I'm gonna go gun to gun with him. And they went gun to gun. You heard? And that that shit was a, and I, that, that's how I learned how real niggas. You know, everybody don't. You know, like if you look at if you look at what's going on now, and you look at these little prison stories and all that niggas be jumping niggas and, 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 and doing niggas dirty man you don't gotta do that all the time you know what I'm saying sometimes what make you who, who you is is you gotta, you gotta handle that shit dolo you know what I'm saying and that was dolo he, he went gun to gun like I said I told you what it what, what it was over but um I, I like I stayed out of that man you know you know what I'm saying I just I was just happy that um 
Little John was, was with the gun to gun joint, you heard? Because it could have been ugly, man. I probably would have got stabbed up and all that because I was dead going out with Dane, you heard? I was dead going out with him, you know what I'm saying? Dane was official nigga, that was my nigga, you heard? I don't know whatever happened to him after that, but I know he had that major beef over his head with them kids, with them brothers, you heard? You know what I'm saying? It take a whole different type of animal to, to, to fuck with that gun for gun shit. Some niggas is on it where it ain't nothing to them. They like, what up? That's mm -hmm. a different that's a different type of animal, man. Know what I mean? Different type of animal, you heard? And 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 that and, 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 that, and I, I seen a lot of that, man. You heard? Like you know in Comstock they got they got some shit called the hole. Mm-hmm. Where like the police can't see really. Yeah. And niggas wanna get it on, they go up in there and do them. You feel what I'm saying? Niggas be going in there gun for gun, all that. You feel what I'm saying? So the maxes be different, my nigga. Yeah. That's why I be that's why I was saying that the that's why I be saying that the maxes is more dangerous than the mediums, you heard? <laughs> the max is way more dangerous because niggas be playing for cheap, big niggas be hitting niggas with bone crushes. Ice picks, you know what I'm saying? And, 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 and niggas ain't playing, B. You know what I'm saying? And yo, man, I I, I learned I learned a lot in them in them. I'm um, you know what by watching niggas and and you know and, do, and doing the do's and the don'ts. You know what I'm saying? You gotta move a certain way, B. You know what I'm saying? But you know that. Like, Shit is crazy, man. I, w I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder what happened to um little John and Dane, big. You heard? What Two year was that? What year was that? Like that was that was nine. That was nine nine. That happened. You heard? Nine nine. Clinton. You heard? That shit was crazy. You know what I'm saying? And then, I, and I, and I, you know, I'm I'm not from Brooklyn, but I heard that Marcy and something in, in the all them projects is close to each other, right? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I heard that the niggas, it, it, it was like a street beef, you know what I'm saying, nigga? nigga. Um, Dane was getting accused of something, I don't know how true it is. He told me out of his own mouth, he ain't do it, you heard? That, but you know how that go, you know what I'm saying? Niggas be having drama, project drama, and, um, and, and, and niggas, and, and niggas, that shit lead right back to the, to the, to the jail cell, you heard? You know what I'm saying? Bump into them niggas, them same, them same, them same killers and all them niggas on the street. You run into them niggas in jail, B. If you make it, you heard? Shit crazy. So I said, don't take the elevator and take the stairs. So he runs down the stairs. So he goes running out the apartment. But before he leaves the apartment, he turns around and he say, yo. When I get that hammer though, what you want me to do? You want me to give it to them? I said, to push my new movie that I got out. You heard called Body Parts, the story of turquoise serial killer in the projects, a true crime story. You heard it's an hour and a half long and it's exclusively on Patreon. So I need y'all true gen pop supporters to come over to the link that's in the description of this video and come watch that movie because it's exclusive, bruh. You heard it's so exclusive, I couldn't just drop it on YouTube.